broken tiles, dirty ceilings, rundown facilities, and an aging infrastructure. This is the reality of the matter for the catering services unit at the CWM hospital in Sudan. It is something that the staff deal with day in, day out. Earlier this week, the Ministry of Health and Medical Services gave local media organizations an opportunity to go behind the scenes and see firsthand the state of infrastructure at CWM. During a press conference after the tour, Permanent Secretary for Health, Dr. James Fong, has made clear the Health Ministry's long-term plans of maintaining the hospital's infrastructure. Again, in the long term, we are hoping that uh, this plan of bringing back government capability to, to maintain, build, uh, maintain uh, government infrastructure on a regular basis can, can, can fall through, again, a program of works. And we are hoping that that program of works, at least for health, will include the program of works that involve uh, a PWD-like entity, and that also involves the community in their ongoing engagement. Uh, as we'd like to, as we, I think one of the key things that we'd like to see is that as we get community engagement in the infrastructure and in the running of facilities, we actually can change, uh, 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 we can change uh, health-seeking behavior. For full updates, visit the Fiji Times website on www.fijitimes.com or grab a copy of the Fiji Times.